Are you ready to uncover the Soviet secret that sent chills through NATO? This is gonna blow your mind, because it's not a plane and it's not a ship. It's something in between. In 1966, Soviet engineers unleashed a beast, the Loon class Ekranoplan. This 500-ton monster flew just 13 feet above the Caspian Sea, skimming the waves at 310 miles per hour. Thanks to something called ground effect, its wings trapped air, letting it float like a hovercraft, but with eight roaring jet engines and six nuclear missiles and tubes mounted to the top. Its mission? To sink U.S. aircraft carriers in a single strike. NATO spies were baffled. They thought it was a UFO until satellite pics revealed this 300-foot-long aluminum terror. But flying the Akranoplan was pure madness. Test pilots hated it. One wrong wave and boom, you flip like a bathtub toy. Soviet engineers joked, it flies like a brick if bricks could carry nukes. By 1987, all three prototypes were history. Why? One crashed and sank to the bottom of the sea, another was cancelled after the collapse of the Soviet Union and the last stayed in service until the late 1990s. Now, the Akranoplan sits rusting away on a beach after its tow lines broke while being taken to a museum for display. It has become a destination for the media, onlookers, and trespassing urban explorers. Want more Soviet machines that broke every rule? Subscribe for more bizarro innovations. Would you dare ride the Caspian Sea Monster? Comment below.